Hello out there, everybody. It's me, Dave, from Dave Station VR, and I'm finally playing Bravo Team. I put it off for a long time. At one point, I thought I would never play it. But for some reason, Crisis on the Planet of the Apes has made me wonder. So I'm going to try it out. There's part of me that wants to play every fucking game, just so I can cover it and uh, tell you guys what I think. So I'm sure you've already seen plenty of reviews of Bravo Team. But uh, uh, we'll, we'll hop into it here and see, see what it's like with a fresh pair of eyes. I have uh, never played this before. I just installed it right now, like a month late. But, you know, I, uh, my lovely Patreon subscribers out there, I just got my donations for this month, and I had a 20% off coupon, and I was like, fuck it, I guess. All right, so I'm sitting, but I'm standing, but I'm sitting, but I'm standing. <clears throat> I hate games where it's like, oh, you're going to be shooting and standing the whole time, but we're going to start with a cutscene where you're sitting to make you feel fucking strange. Just, I mean, everybody around me is sitting. My body's sitting. My gun is massive. Super massive. Everything's funky large in here. Hey, what's up, Roy Schwartz? What do we got in here? Everybody's favorite, right? Oh, what's on that phone? Let me grab that phone. Ah. Maybe if I have the move controllers, I could grab the phone and see what's going on. So who's this lady? Hey Kyle, thanks for uh, tuning in, man. Congrats. All right, so I have not. Ooh, you bought it physical, right? Smart man, smart man. You return that shit. Turn it, return it. Oh, Julian didn't think it was too bad. Well, you know, I've had some time to separate myself from both the hype and the backlash. So uh, we'll see. We'll see what I think here. Now, is my mic too loud, guys? Because I just turned it up a minute ago for my last stream. Um, so let me know if I'm, like, blowing your ears out or anything. What is this lady doing? Oh, jeez, okay. That guy did not react at all. Oh, I got a translator in my ear. That's sweet. Oh, Wipeout is always good for rocking. Okay, so I'm I'm supposed to be uh, getting getting used to this lady, getting to getting a feel for her. I'm supposed to uh, feel upset when she gets exploded or stolen or whatever happens. I think the whole game is saving this president. Uh, she seems like a nice lady. She's got pictures of kids on her phone. You know, she's taking a phone call. Will my translator tell me what she's saying on her phone call? That would be nice. All right. Well, I'm standing, but I'm sitting in this jeep. Oh my god, something's going on. There's gunfire on the other line. Oh my god, we exploded! Oh my god, I don't know what the fucking plot is. I've never played this. I didn't even watch Let's Plays. I was just like, eh, fuck this game. But I was feeling feisty, and I fucking got it. I don't know. Is there a plot? I mean, I don't need a plot if I'm just shooting guys. It's not the end of the world. Yeah, it'd be nice to get... Wait, so everything blew up, but she's okay. Oh, look, I looked at my own face. You can look at your own face. Hey, look, that's me. Wow, this is a weird out-of-body experience. Is this what happens when you're in, like, an explosion? You start floating out of your body. Oh, my gee. Oh, my goodness. I'm looking at myself, looking at the president. Whoa. She's gone. She did get kidnapped. I was right. Yeah. Yeah, I actually bought it. But like I was saying earlier, I just got my uh, my Patreon subscriber stuff in today. And I was looking at it and I was like, you know, those people are great. Thanks so much for sending the money. And I'm just going to use it, I guess, to buy fucking Bravo Team and put more back into the channel. Because I never covered it. I figured I, I should cover it, I guess. And after playing Planet of the Apes, for some reason I want to play a cover-based shooter that's a, a full game. I know this is going to be <laughs> worse than Planet of the Apes, but that's fine. Okay, so let's get me out of here. Yeah, let's get me out of here. One of my least favorite things in VR is loading screens uh, that are based on where your head's facing when they start. So, like, you'll be looking forward for most of the game, and then you turn down for a second. And then your loading screen's, like, over here. Are you fucking weird? Okay. Oh, what am I doing? Am I, am I crouching? Am I sitting? I feel weird. Okay. Here's my gun. Too close to the TV. 
Got my gun. Can I shoot it? Okay. This looks like a gun. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. My, my buddy. My pal. Wait, is, am I looking at myself again? This game is all about out-of-body experiences. <clears throat> hey, clever multimedia, what's going on? Okay, so is this how you, how do you move? How do you move? How does one move? Wait, what's the deal with the turning? Wait, how do, what? How do I move? Guys, how do I fucking move in this game? Okay, I'm shooting. Oh, X. I hit X to move. Okay, got it. And then I get to watch myself go. Oh my goodness. Okay, so I'm popping out of cover. I'm shooting at them. How do I reload? Square? Of course, square reloads. Hey, I'm in cover! I'm in cover, you motherfuckers. Is this bad cover? That's bad cover. I need other cover. Oh, jeez, I'm gonna die. I shouldn't have put this on veteran. Can I switch to rookie? I need to switch this to rookie. Hey, uh, is this guy gonna come revive me? Thanks, bud. Oh, you're the greatest. And now I'm ready for more. Oh, I can tell him what to do. Yeah, I see that. I thought this was the fucking tutorial. Okay, die. Jeez, 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 jeez. Come on. I swear I shot that guy. Yeah, cover doesn't work very well. I feel like I'm in cover and I keep getting shot. And then when you run between cover, you're just a fucking sitting duck. It's terrible. I don't know how the health works. Is it like the regenerating type health? Oh, the tutorial's separate? Well, fuck a tutorial. I don't need a tutorial. I'm fine. I've been playing VR my whole life. That's not true. Okay, uh, let's get over here. That guy's done. How limited is my ammo situation here? Like, I see I've only got 128. I don't see where I pick up more ammo. Is that ammo? This looks like ammo. Yo, give me that ammo, though. Wait, 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 are you kidding? Is he just gonna crawl like an idiot? Okay, there you go, jeez. Take the ammo. Take the ammo, bud. Thanks, guys. I appreciate having a tutorial <laughs> in chat form. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. Yeah, he didn't know what was going on anyways. What's up, Anthony? All right. So far, there's a bunch of guys on this bridge. They really want me dead. Oh, more ammo. Sweet. I wonder if I'll get shot while I'm reloading. Nope. I guess I can direct my teammate where to go, but he seems to know what he's doing. Now, you can play this online with people. I should have tried that. But I kind of doubt anybody's playing it online actively. Enough to get, like, a match going at any given time. Could be wrong. Who knows? Okay. Uh, can I move to the cover? I want to move to the cover. There we go. Hey, Sonny. How's it going? Oh, God. That was a bad spot. Oh jeez, it's a whole fucking it's a whole fucking truck. Oh, you can switch between Where did that guy come from? My teammate is not protecting me at all. What the fuck? Yo, dude, I need your help over here. Are you going to come get me? Is somebody going to come save me? Do I need to put this on easy mode? It's the first stage. Come on, teammate. I expect some good AI out of you. Oh, he's getting shot. He's going to die. He's definitely going to die. Oh, God. Look at him. He's taking so many bullets. How the fuck did he survive that? Oh, my God. That guy's invincible. That guy's a fucking monster. Okay, I shot the, the dude in the tank like a million times already. That's fine. Why doesn't the cover actually protect you? What the fuck? Why doesn't the cover actually protect you? One of the main things of a time crisis like cover-based shooter is that if you fucking pop out of cover, you can get shot. And if you're in cover, you can't get shot. And I keep fucking getting shot. This is terrible. I mean, I just started, but fuck me. I need a drink. Oh, come save me. Is this just, like, infinite? Like, he's just gonna come save me forever?
Oh god damn it. No, I'm trying to wait, I think I accidentally put it on single shot mode. Oh no, I have a pistol now. I should have played the tutorial. I'm gonna die again. That guy's gonna Oh god, fuck me, fuck me. Yo, I need to get to some different cover. Fuck me. I'm gonna die on the way, I'm sure. This tank! This tank is not fucking around. I swear I've shot the dude in the tank like 60 times. I and I'm fucking dead again. Okay, hey, this is a lot of fun. I love getting those uh, defibrillators. Those are very helpful. I know I need to keep moving forward. I guess I guess that's one thing that I forgot is actually I forgot that. How do I turn it back off a single fire mode? Yeah, no, I already hate it. But uh, I'm gonna play the tutorial, guys. Okay, I've heard I've heard enough thing going on here. Everybody's saying play the tutorial. Yeah, that's really stupid. That's fucking stupid. You gotta move forward or the en enemies just keep coming. Uh, I, I, they don't really explain that to you. I know I've heard that before. But in practice, it's weird because you like shoot guys and you're like, all right, I'm doing fine. Uh, fucking even Planet of the Apes got that right better than this did. All right, single player tutorial. Let's learn what I'm doing wrong. Study the battlefield and move wisely. I think they think this game is is better than it is. Oh, yeah, okay. Press X to advance. Oh, in easy mode they don't keep coming? Well, that's fucking stupid. I mean, everybody should just play on easy mode then. That sounds like an actual game. Uh, well, I'm just gonna play it on easy then. And I kept dying anyways. I don't give a shit. Okay, this is the tutorial. This is how you walk. Oh, you can lean in and out of cover. Great. How's he gonna get up there? Oh, I thought he was gonna jump that thing. Nope, here we go. No bullets in the tutorial. Oh, why would you want to play hard mode? I guess you like this game though, right, Julian? This is Julian in here. We got one guy who likes the game. Oh, you can press circle to go back to your last one. God, this is fucking ridiculous, though, with a third-person camera. Oh, no, not that one. No, 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 no. Go forward. God damn it. Okay, how do I... Okay, let's, let's do this again. This is what it's like training to be a soldier, guys. It's already disorienting. Why don't I just fucking stay in uh, in first person mode? And you can't defend yourself at all when you're walking. It's totally stupid. Oh, delightful. A stealth kill. I don't even have to do anything. No, it's not better than Planet of the Apes AWOL. I mean, I don't know yet, but I liked Planet of the Apes okay. It wasn't great. I'm not saying it was great. But for ten bucks... It's not that bad. This game was 40, 50, 40, 50, something like that. All right, what now? Where? What am I doing here? Uh, I've seen. Oh, they want me to go there. Reviving your partner. Press X to revive. Oh, that dude's dead. I'm gonna go save him. Bam. Portable defibs. You're all good, soldier. Following your lead. I don't think I need to play the tutorial. You guys were all telling me to play the tutorial. I think I'm just fine. I think I'm just fucking fine. I, I figured all this out. Yeah, I think the main issue was the price point and just that everybody was, uh... Wait. Wait. For extra accuracy and to check your ammo. Look down sight. Okay, got it. It was too overpriced. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I think the hype and the price. Yeah, if it was a cheap game, I don't think anybody would have any problem with it, honestly. And if it was by maybe a different <laughs> developer, 
Uh, you know, if this was just some little game that came out, cost you 15, 20 bucks, had a campaign, aim support, people would like this game. Okay, follow, move, locate, stop. I'm not gonna remember any of that shit. Are you kidding? Left, this doesn't even make sense. Left is follow, up is move, right is locate, back is stop. All right, follow me. Oh, jeez. Who the fuck came up with infinite enemies? That's a pretty dumb idea. Oh, nobody should pay more for this than Skyrim. That's... that's bonkers. Okay, was that the whole tutorial? Because I'm done. I'm ready. Let's move on. Let's get to it. It's game time. It's game time. Here we go. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Game mode. Now, guys, if I go online, do you think I'll actually find anybody? I kind of doubt that I will, but maybe I'll just stick to AI for now. All right. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Start the single player game. I'm a rookie this time. I don't give a shit. Not about dying over and over again. Just to play this silly little game. Stealth. Yeah, if anybody's got it, you know, still has it and wants to fucking play, you know, hit me up. Could try out the multiplayer. Oh, we're all good. Got to do all this again. All right, I'm going to do much better this time, guys. I learned, I relearned everything in the tutorial that I already learned by dying. Oh no, he's been shot. Yep. She should say, you always have to move forward at all times, or else you're fucked. So now I, I am going to play it the right way, I guess, which is just like running forward the entire time. God damn it. God damn it. I'm still getting shot, though. Still getting shot. The cover is fucking annoying because you think you're in cover. You think you're in cover. And then you're fucking not. Okay, gonna get some ammo and get the hell out of this little spot. Uh, that's not cover at all, is it? That's like open. Okay, moving forward, moving forward. All right, let's just keep running. Fuck all this shit. What's going on? Is that the tank I'm supposed to fight later just sitting there? Is that are my teammate still fighting, guys? <coughs> There's guys way back there still shooting at me. Do I have to kill them to move on? Like, where is there to go? There's nowhere else to go. Wait, do I... So are there endless enemies, but if you move forward and don't kill them... They respawn, or they, they sit there, and you gotta kill them to progress? What the fuck is this game? Oh, no, that's not cover. That's not cover, you fuck. Okay, can we get the hell out of here now? I got it. Okay, what? I've ki I'm shooting everyone. What's the deal? Am I going the wrong way? Did I start running the wrong way somehow? What the fuck is going on? Is there a guy behind me? Is there a fucking guy behind me? You son of a bitch. I'm not gonna die like that. I will not die like that. Fuck you. Jesus Christ. 
Okay, now this is the right way, I guess. <laughs> so do I just run past the tank? Am I supposed to just run past the fucking tank? Oh god. I'm gonna die before I get there. God, you're not covering me. You didn't cover me. You didn't do shit. You're sitting there getting your fucking ass shot in the head. Okay, now you're saving me. Oh, jeez. I fucking... I thought I would like this game more than I do. Uh, I don't know why. I knew it would suck. But I thought maybe there'd be some redeeming shit about it. Basically, at this point... What the fuck am I doing? Yeah, I did the Predator giveaway already. Sorry. Uh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh yeah, for sure. I look. Uh, I like a good Spider-Man game. Broken cover system and just like stupid enemy spawning. Just like I don't even get how the fuck you're supposed to like. I mean, I know that you just keep moving forward, but like, at what point do you decide? Okay, I've killed enough guys. I'm not gonna get shot in the ass. This is fucking annoying. Okay, well, at least this guy's gonna come save me, right? Don't die, man. Please don't die. I need you. I really need you. It's the first stage on easy, and I'm getting my ass handed to me. Time Crisis is honestly one of my favorite fucking games. Like, as a child, I love Time Crisis. I had the Gun Con on my PlayStation, and I love that shit. But this... Oh my god, from behind? What the fuck? What the fuck am I supposed to do, man? Move forward, move forward. But wait, there's gonna be a guy sitting behind you shooting you in the ass for some fucking reason. You can never tell when they've stopped spawning or when you're fucking... Jeez. Ah, Are we almost fucking done with this stage yet? Okay, something happened. What is that? Let's get ourselves the hell out of it. I'm ready to... Okay, let's fucking bail out of here. I'm going, I'm going, Jesus. Hey, Twix! Not sure why I bought this. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Two kills and you'll move up to the next scoring tier. What's wrong with looking down? I don't see shit. Oh, I guess we're high up. They don't really convey that very well because it's just like gray and fucking stupid. All right, hold on, pausing to take a drink. So, uh, consensus. Does this game get any better, or was that, was that, uh, was that it? Have I seen <laughs> the height of fucking Bravo Team? Oh, he says it gets better. Fucking running. I'm just moving forward. Does seem like it will be the whole, same thing the whole game. Are there any different enemy types besides just these guys who shoot at you with the assault rifles? Do you get any different guns? Dude, what the fuck? How am I supposed to shoot those guys from all the way over there? I guess I'll move up. Well, that was fucking stupid. God, that was fucking stupid. Oh, jeez. I'm really bad at this, even on Rookie. But I, I blame the game. I don't blame myself. I don't blame myself. Just fucking hard to stay in cover and not get shot. Because even in cover, you get fucking shot. It's not as arcadey as it wants to be. It's trying to be a fucking tactical shooter where you have to, like, smartly choose what your cover is going to be. But you can't fucking... Ah! Oh, I'm going to fucking rage at this game. All right. It's just not hard for any good reason. If it was hard for some fucking good reason, I wouldn't be upset. But I'm just getting shot, and it doesn't seem to matter because your fucking dude revives you all the time. Enemy types are the same the whole way through? Alright, so it's, it is Planet of the Apes. 
Are they shooting from behind me? Where the fuck are they? Okay, god. Whoo, boy. This is it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Just constant gunfire. You don't know where the fuck you're getting shot from sometimes. You can't shoot people from a distance. It's so blurry. Oh, Jesus Christ. I guess I'll move up. What the fuck am I supposed to do? List, look at this guy with the glasses. Oh, he doesn't have glasses. Wait. Why is he standing there? Wait, there's hostiles? Coming here? No. I haven't seen any hostiles. Oh wait, you mean this guy? The same guy? The, the guy they cloned like 80,000 of who keeps shooting at me? Yeah, I can use the pistol. Is it better? Should I be using the pistol? What's the, what's the fucking point of using the pistol? I guess it works. It works pretty well. Actually, I kind of like the pistol way better than the fucking, uh... I like the pistol better than the other gun. I think I'm going to stick with the pistol. I'm a pistol man. God damn it. Where are you shooting? Is there a guy there? What the fuck? Where is he? Oh, jeez. All right. Ugh. There's this fucker. Jesus Christ, I'm trying to be in cover. This this game, the cover system fucking sucks. I'm I'm really, really, where am I even getting fucking shot from? Where did I get shot from? Where did I get shot from? I don't even know how stealth would factor into this because the whole game is just like 80 guys fucking shooting you the entire time. Yo, teammate, a little help. I'm bleeding out over here. Well, I guess this is when I take a drink. If I lose this stage, I'm going to be really upset. I don't want to play it again. I just want to go to the next one. Paul, I think it got released, yeah, just, uh, just recently. I'm hearing good stuff about it, too. So I figured I had to see for myself, you know. Oh, God damn it. Oh, fuck me. Wrong cover. Wrong cover. God, fuck me. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. All right. All right. I'm going to go here. There's a guy. I know there's a guy. Where is he? Where the fuck? Ah. Oh, my God. Fuck. Fuck. P please revive me. I don't want to do this again. I don't ever want to do this again. Teammate, I need you, man. I need you. Where are you, bud? You're my only hope. Fucking AI. Oh, dude, get over here. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, I knew it was going to be like this. Guys, Planet of the Apes is way better than this game. Go buy Planet of the Apes. If you have any interest in a cover-based shooter, buy fucking Planet of the Apes. Because this is the worst fucking cover-based shooter I've ever played in my fucking life. I don't know why Supermassive was like, hey, I think we can make a shooter. We'll be able to do that. I mean, after Until Dawn, you know, we're feeling pretty confident about our ability to make a fucking cover-based tactical military shooter with no fucking music that's stupidly hard for no reason because there's a million guys coming out of every fucking place in the map and they never shut up and they never stop. And you fucking die constantly. Cover isn't cover. No cover matters. There's always some fucking asshole waiting to shoot you in the butt. Some guy waiting around the corner. Your teammate invariably comes and saves you. Every time he's such a good little AI guy. Come, come kill all these guys. There's a bunch of them. I need your help. Half of this game is me just sitting and waiting to get revived.
Dude, he did that while there were guys, like, next to us. Okay, fuck this. I'm moving forward. I don't even... Sometimes I don't even know which way is forward, though. And I end up going backwards. I don't fucking know which way is forward. I'm gonna die again. I'm gonna fucking die again. Okay, is this way forward? I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. No, I think the other way is forward. God, fuck. God damn it. Okay, we're moving forward. We're heading towards the goal. It's all in sight now, guys. I just need to kill 18,000 more of these fucking guys. And then I'll be good. And I just need to keep moving. Just keep moving. Just keep on moving. The soul of combat is running forward. I read that. The military tactics textbook. Ooh, I hopped over that one. This guy doesn't know what's going on. <laughs> Should have reacted faster, you dumb little computer. I'm going to the pistol. I want the pistol. Boop, boop, boop. He didn't even see that coming. Where did you come from, buddy? Okay, guys. Can we stop with this? Can we stop with this? Well, don't run behind me, you fucking ass. Okay, thanks, teammate. Okay, can we stop with the fucking guys here? I have not tried the VRFC update yet. Uh, unfortunately. I will I will give it a shot soon. Where, what am I... Where am I fucking going? Is this the right way? I'm gonna kill this guy over here. Where is forward? What the fuck is forward? There, you're supposed to move forward. I don't know where... Oh, yes, out of here. Yes, out of here. Let's get the fuck. Come on, teammate. Let's let's bail. Oh my god. Oh, Justin, why? Why, man? I don't even know why I'm playing it. He loves it. It's fucking frustrating the hell out of me. I don't know. Oh, we're back on the bridge. Lots of tangos. Guys, you know, they said multiple tangos. What they meant was infinite tangos. The tangos never stop. And they're all the same. We've actually had a couple people in the stream who, who said that they sort of like this one. Um, <laughs> you get used to it, he says. If you choose the right spots to move to, it's, it works. Well, first impressions are not positive. Get out of here. Get out of here. I'm going to shoot you in the ass. Got him. You shoot me through a car. That's not cover. This isn't cover. I'm not in cover. I'm totally exposed. What the fuck is this cover system? They shouldn't allow you to choose cover spots that are fucking garbage. They should have good, good spots to go to. If you're gonna force me to do this sort of movement, and like, picking the wrong spot makes me run around like an idiot in third person view, at least make the cover spots actual cover fucking kill me. You can't shoot while you're running. You ought to be able to, yeah. Why didn't I hop the car? I wanted to hop the car. Where the fuck did you come from? Who is... Sh oh, who is shooting me? I am tired of this business. I'm gonna blind fire until I kill you. Did that work? That kind of worked. I just don't like the flow of this game. Like, it's really weird because you never know when to move forward because you fucking, you know, there's always guys in front of you, no matter what. You can't be like, oh, I've cleared out all the guys, let me move forward. And if you move too fast, there's some dude you didn't even fucking realize was there shooting you in the ass and you die, which is probably what's happening, or I'm in a spot that isn't actually covered because it's just a fucking broken out window. Honestly, if if you don't have high expectations for a game that costs this much, 
from the people who made Russia Blood? What? I had really... Everybody had really high expectations. Um, the hype was too much because they... I don't know. They just sort of misrepresented it. People got excited about something they imagined instead of something that actually existed. Oh, God. What's happening? What the fuck's happening? Did I get him? I got him. Okay. Oh, I feel super massive. Okay. Can we get out of here? Is this the get out of here button? I'm tired of bridges with cars. Like, how many... What percentage of the stages in this game are um, bridges with cars on them? It ain't Farpoint, that's for sure. Farpoint is like fucking game of the decade compared to this. He's got it covered! He's got it covered. Although I'm still getting shot while I'm in cover. Okay, let's move up. That's what you're supposed to do, right? This seems like a good hidey spot. Third playthrough. Well, I don't think I'm going to play it through three times on my stream right now. But maybe I'll play it a little more and review it later. Okay, so part of a cover-based shooter is they stop shooting at some point, right? So you can pop out of cover. Because it seems like they just keep fucking shooting. And no matter what I do, I'm going to get shot. All right, I'm tired of this shit. I can't even shoot through the fucking... That cover is terrible! This cover fucking sucks! If you just stuck with what made Time Crisis fun, and I, I, so I'm sure you guys have read that Eurogamer article about this game, or at least heard about it, in terms of like uh, what happened and why it turned out the way it did, and uh, it makes a lot of sense. Supermassive was working on way too many games at the same time. They got in over their head. They thought they could fucking make this game. Uh, of course, they couldn't. They couldn't. It was impossible for them. Just because they didn't give it enough time, enough uh, developers, enough love. And uh, that's what we got. All right, I guess we're going to go sneak up on this guy. Yo, stealth. I love stealth. This is like Metal Gear Solid or something in VR. Quote me on that, developers. You can put that on the box. It's like Metal Gear Solid in VR. Dude, I don't, I don't reload. I don't use ammo. Fine. Nope. They put all their eggs in too many baskets. If they put all their eggs in this basket, we'd be just fine. But they put their eggs in a shitty basket that was a bunch of baskets. They put it in a bunch of shitty baskets. Are you kidding me? Are you actually trying to make stealth happen in this game? Are you literally trying to make stealth happen? You gotta be fucking kidding me. Yeah, right? There's no music in the goddamn game. Because people uh, wouldn't understand where it was coming from. Because the game is so realistic that no one would be able to understand why there's fucking music in it. That's what the executives at Supermassive thought. Oh, you know what I forgot? If I keep standing here, they're just going to keep coming. So I can't do that. I need to fucking move. God damn this game. Why can't I just shoot a few guys? Those are the guys there to shoot. And then I move forward. Who the fuck came up with endless enemies? Endless enemies? Yeah, so, okay, so you got to stay immersed. Uh, people would ask questions if there was music playing in the background. But nobody asks questions if there's fucking 30,000... Like, if I sat here for 10 minutes, 
there would be an endless stream of enemies. They would never stop coming. Doesn't that break the immersion a little fucking more than not having music? Ah, oh, this game's pissing me off. This game is really pissing me off, guys. Are, are you fucking playing around? Get a- oh, Jesus. No, this is not cover! This cover's not cover. Fuck me. Police, help me! Dude, you don't have shit covered, teammate. Hostiles incoming straight ahead, really? Like, you mean like the way they were the whole fucking game? Coming straight ahead? Never stopping? Okay, we're getting out of here. We're getting out of here. I'll just run right through that guy. Look! He just decided he would go the other way. And I'm down. I'm fucking down. I, you know, honestly, sometimes I don't mind, because when I'm just chilling, waiting for my teammate to come get me, I don't have to be playing, and it's just kind of a l relaxing break. I can take a drink. I don't have to worry about actively engaging with this fucking game. Oh, look, I'm alive again. So, oh, thank you. I'm so glad. Nothing I wanted more than to be revived so I could play this game a little more. Let's get out of here, teammate. Is there a way? Yes. Through the door. Going through the door. What the fuck was that? Oh, that's how that's how we go through doors. Buddy system. You gotta wait for your buddy. I don't like it either. It's too quiet because there's no fucking music. Thanks, Paul. I appreciate the support. God, Sega needs to get on this shit. Seriously. Sega needs to be up in the VR arcade shooter all over the place. I would love it. This is just so fucking boring and military and bland looking. It's not well made. Is this where I'm supposed to go? Are there branching paths? Oh goodness. I can choose the stealthy path. No, there's. it's all the same guy. So in a game like Planet of the Apes, where it's fucking... Oh, look. This is going to be stealthy. I got this motherfucker right here. Creeping, creeping. Just creeping. Oh, no. He saw me. I guess I wasn't stealthy enough. <clears throat> but in a game like Planet of the Apes, I'm not too upset if there's just one enemy the whole time. Because, honestly, it's a $10 game. It's not the end of the world. I didn't expect a whole lot. This fucking game. $40. 40, 50 bucks? I don't know how much it costs. 40? Uh, certainly not the correct price. Come on. Oh wait, there's no reason to hide in cover and keep shooting guys because they'll just keep coming. I guess I'll just move forward. Oh, Hatsune Miku of the Dead. I'll play that shit. That sounds incredible. That's right up my alley, actually. Why are there so many fucking dudes? I think this one is, uh... It didn't make it into my top 200 VR games, but it might be in the top 300. Alright, I'm just gonna run right up in this guy's face because I assume a uh, reverse my position. But wait, they're everywhere. They're always everywhere. They're always fucking everywhere. Okay, let's just go. I'm just gonna go. Fuck this. I'm out. Run right past that guy. God damn it. They just sit and they point and they know how to hit you from really far away. And they just get you over and over again. Time Carnage is not out yet, but I actually did play a little bit of it. Uh, I can't say a whole lot because there's an embargo, but I got a code earlier today. And uh, Time Carnage is definitely a wave shooter. Definitely a wave shooter, but it's kind of cool. It's got some fun elements and um, lots of stuff to unlock. But I'll be able to say more on Friday, I think. I think I can stream it on Friday. Okay, so we're in like a busted out cafe. No enemies here for some reason. Uh, I guess we're gonna have to 
teamwork our way through this door. Get over here, pal. Let's do it. Let's get through that door. Wait. Uh... I thought I was moving forward. Oh, here we go. Okay. Hey, Pasqual. How's it going? Price of Time Carnage? I don't actually know the price. That's a good question. I would think, based on what it looks like, 20 bucks or less. Um, there's a lot of stuff to unlock. Decent amount of streams. Streams? What am I talking about? I saw Paul say stream, and I just said that. Decent amount of stuff to unlock these amount of stages. We'll talk about it on Friday. Go, go, go! Yeah, no, I hadn't heard anything until today. Uh, I just got one. So. 13 quid, he says. What is a, what is a quid to a, a dollar? It's like a 1.5? What's the conversion rate at this point? Alright, so I think they want us to be stealthy, but don't give a shit. Don't give a shit. This game sucks. Alright, I'm in cover. Hey, look at this. Can I jump over the wall? How do I, uh, I guess I, I don't want to be in cover over here because everything sucks when you're this far away. This cover also sucks. It's real shit. Okay, we'll go down. That's what I thought. Something like that. Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, who's shooting me now? Who the fuck's shooting me now? I thought I was in cover. <sighs> There's guys fucking everywhere. Look at this fucking guy. He can shoot me in cover. I know this is supposed to be tactical, but how the fuck are you supposed to be tactical when you're dealing with a literally never-ending wave of enemies where, like, if you pick a tactical position and you kill a guy, like, unless you immediately run forward and risk getting shot by a bunch of other fucking dudes, you're just, uh, this is fucking stupid. I hate, I kind of hate this game. Oh, come on. Am I really out of ammo for the pistol? Okay, stop fucking shooting me, everybody. I also can't hit anything. Can't hit anything. Is this guy alive or dead? I'm dead. Jesus. Fuck. Okay. Alright. Okay, how do you switch back to fucking single fire mode? Because I feel like my accuracy is just total shit. Who the fuck is shooting me right now? I shot you already, dude! Why aren't you dead? Oh my fucking god. They have shotguns now. They have shotguns now. Are you kidding? I'm... Why can't I shoot there? Why can't I shoot there? Okay, I've been in the same spot for obviously way too long, because these guys just don't stop. They, they put so much emphasis on realism, they were like, in the development, if you read that fucking Eurogamer article, they're like, oh no, we can't do this because it's not, it's not realistic enough. Oh no, there can't be any music because it would take people out of the realism. We're two guys fighting an endless army of fucking faceless dudes. That's that's not unrealistic? Like, you, wh what are the odds that two guys would be able to kill? What is this? Have I shot in like 13,000 guys already? How the fuck? Like, this doesn't make any sense. The other thing is, my teammate can endlessly revive me. Uh, regardless of how many gunshot wounds I've sustained. Just with a defibrillator, no big deal. That doesn't kill the immersion or realism at all. Jesus Christ, they should have made this an arcade game. They should have made it actually fucking fun. That's not cover! Why isn't this cover cover? I wish the cover was fucking cover. That cover looks like cover. 
I can't stay here too long, because there's going to be like 19 guys coming. Alright, let's get out of here. Whoo! I'm going to have to take a rage break on this one pretty, pretty soon. I might come back and play the rest of it, but after this stage I am... Oh boy, I gotta take a fucking break. This is ridiculous. Can we go through one of these doors? Let's go through the door. Wait, are you kidding? Okay, there we go. Let's bust through. Are these stages? Are these different stages? Oh, minutes, great, yeah. No, I like minute. Wasn't the, it wasn't the greatest stream. I ended up deleting that live stream because it you couldn't hear me at all. All right. So is this a new stage or like what fucking? How do you how do I know what stage I'm on or what's going on? I guess there's no way to know. This is my first time playing this, Justin. Yep, I've never ever played it before. It's been out for a month. Everybody else and their mom covered it. I was holding out, and today I decided fuck it because I got some good Patreon money this month, and I was like, you know what? I should cover every game I can cover, even if it's a real big hunk of garbage, and I hate myself for buying it, and I hate myself for playing it, and I've had to take a piss for the last five or ten minutes, and I just am real frustrated. Real frustrated. Oh, get to cover! There's a chopper inbound! Is any cover gonna be good enough to protect me against this fucking co chopper? I don't know. I'm real tired of this game. Oh, there was the ammo right there. Jesus Christ. Hey, have fun, Paul. Are you streaming Trackmania again? I haven't uh, streamed Trackmania recently, but it is free, so maybe I should stop playing this fucking game and play some Trackmania. Oh god, I guess I need to move forward, don't I? Am I ever gonna get another gun? This- oh, this fucking sucks! This is a fucking nightmare! They're everywhere! They're fucking everywhere! There's no good cover! This little box isn't cover! This is nothing! Okay. God, let me die! My one wish. Let me die. All right, Paul, enjoy yourself. Have a good time, man. Thanks for tuning in. God, where? 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 Where the fuck am I getting shot from? Okay, guys. All right. All right. I'm going to take a break. Thanks for watching. I might play some more of this later. I might not. I don't fucking know. I bought it for some reason. Uh, I felt obligated to show you guys what I thought of it, I guess. And I didn't know what I would think of it. And here's what I'll say, go buy Planet of the Apes if you want this game. It's only 10 bucks. It starts out slow, but it's a way better cover shooter. Uh, this is like some of the worst garbage I've played on PSVR. Ah, oh, jeez. It could have been so good, guys. It could have been so good. Alright, well, thanks for watching. I will uh, catch you later on. Have a good night.